Well, it looks like we made it past the peak of the Delta surge weeks ahead of schedule. North Carolina is averaging only about half as many new cases a day as we were just about three weeks ago. And tonight, CBS 17 digital reporter Jody McCrary is digging deeper into what we did right to get to this point. An expert tells me the key is enough of us now have at least some protection from the virus, one way or another. It may reflect that there's a lot of people out there who are getting more immune. Two months ago, UNC doctor David Wall told me the models he tracks pointed to a peak around Halloween. Instead, we got there quicker, and the reasons all center around immunity. Worries about Delta led more people to get the vaccine. Employers began requiring the shots for their workers, and thousands more now have natural immunity after catching the virus. Putting these all together, Maybe with some good luck because weather has been warm and people haven't been driven inside. Uh, we're not seeing as many new infections as maybe we projected. Models now project those numbers to keep falling for the next few months. But Wall says that might not account for the weather. So when temperatures drop and we wind up indoors more often around the holidays, we could be in for another spike. I think the confluence of all those things could lead to a bump. But what could it look like? Wall doesn't expect it to be quite as big as it was last winter, because so many of us are protected. I think it may be more like a camel hump. And in my story online, when the weather gets cooler, find out the one thing Dr. Wall says you should not do. For CBS 17 News, I'm Jody McCrary. Jody, thank you. Senate lawmakers passed an no page.